on tips on maintaining the lid. Yo, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, guys? Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. And if you're new here, hi, my name is June Gare. I do content that relates to moms, lifestyle, and beauty. So in this video, we are still on everything breast pump series. And today, guys, we are reviewing an electric breast pump. I'm whopping my coffee. <laughs> Yes, guys, so we are reviewing this particular one over here. It's called the Intelligent RH228 Automatic Double Breast Pump. So I asked you guys on Instagram to suggest which pump I should get because I'm going to lose my coins because I've been disappointed twice. Twice. And this is what you guys suggested because this is what most of you guys are using. And that's why I got it. So let's get straight to it. And if you haven't followed me on Instagram, my name is June Gary. So you can check me out there. Meanwhile, let's get to this. So guys, this is our electric pump and it is called Intelligent RH228. I don't know what number stands for, but this is a double breast pump. As you can see from the illustration over there so this is an extra nipple in case you are bottle feeding so these are the two um, bottles and this is our source of electricity this is how our packaging looks like yes so let's get straight into it plus let me show you guys you it has options of color so there's white blue and pink i love that about it but see at in chupa and yoziko this is a colors it's only the what the source of power you don't need different colors so yes let's get straight into opening it enjoy you are eager to see what's inside and how the inside looks like so did i mention that we are pretend we are pretending to open it for the first time so yay Pretend it's me, guys. <laughs> so yes, guys. I got it and had to test it and how see how effective it is. The first um, time I saw this packaging, I was so 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 impressed because this means that I can just pack everything here again and just carry it everywhere uh, where I am going. So. This is how everything looks the first time I got it. So let's try to toy it. Kila kitu, kila kitu, kila kitu. So then we have two bottles. Remember it's a double pump, so everything is equal double, double. So we have two of this also. So let's deal with this first. So this is how you assemble. First of all, this part, let's talk about this part. Again, sorry guys, I'm adjusting you and you are going to So yes, um, this is how this part looks like. This is where the breast goes in, of course. And then there's this part over here, which has two parts inside. So gonna heal part, and this is what covers this part over here. So happened mahali you'll see movement like this when you connect it to electricity so this part goes here it is so easy to assemble in a kujatri kikwaibi so you just have to cram and know where everything is supposed to go so this one also goes here same as the other one so that's just it what we are just going to do right now nikufunga so we just close it up like that Let's do the other part. I'm not going to like show you everything I've done in the first bottle because the same. They're training guys. There's nothing different about it. So that's it. Even the car. Yes. Even those in a car. So let's put these ones aside first and I show you guys what is left inside here. So we also have an instruction manual which 
um, has everything that you need to know about assembling the components inside plus the names preparation make sure that you have clean sterilized and all that wash your hands before you handle and caution how to operate as in everything everything plus breast milk storage and breast milk heating disinfection methods this is very important before you um, handle this make sure that you go through this instruction manual but this is the instruction manual which is very easy to understand then inside we have the cable because you guys remember it is an electric breast pump so we have each of the, the bottles so we have one and two because there are two bottles it is a double electric pump then we have this and also we have this cable so that's that what's left inside here is these are breast shields just to shield your you from getting bad on milk and this is a nipple this is what goes on the bottle CJ can work now say if you work in the room. <laughs> you understand this is just the part in immune so he in your tuna for nikia hapa on this bottle oh, oh this is what you for nikia hapa on this bottle while you are feeding your baby there's that and then this is our source of power so that's what is contained in this intelligent automatic double press pump so it comes in with three cables or rather just one cable because in the steamer so let's start with that this cable this is what you connect to your source of power and what goes here they haven't included it included it <laughs> in the packaging so i'm using this part this is for my phone so that you'll need this remember if you're buying the specific pump i don't know about the other brands for electric pumps if they have this but i doubt so if you're buying this specific breast pump you'll need this caffeine so that goes there and the end of this cable goes here in case you're using the double one you're using both bottles so this one goes there and then let's put this up a candle and connect these two pipes next this how we assemble everything this is why you should subscribe to this channel ah mommy make sure that channel shows you how to connect a breast pump who has that time <laughs> So this end comes here like that and the end of this you put that aside then the end of this cable this pipe I mean comes here it comes here Hapo. then the same thing that you've done to that part you do this bottle so you do the same exact thing so make a hopper like that and then you connect it to sorry you connect it to this part like that and then that's it that's it guys so you use this part connected to a source of power so i'm going to show you and that is done so yeah guys i have connected it to my source of electricity and there you go so you have the on button when it's on it should be red in color then there's plus minus and then there's this this is for stimulation and expression so stimulation is just the feeling of stimulating milk to just come out just the feeling of naturally um, like how the baby feeds on you so when you press there it should be blue in color so this plus is for sanction sanction is how the baby sucks on your nipple so that is the same feeling that you should get 
and this is how it is hapa i hope it is clear that you guys can see can you see this part that is what helps with um, pumping milk and like this for electric pump this is what it does for manual it's so different i hope you've watched my manual uh review of breast pump so the feeling is different so this is how it looks like over here that is when usha press volume and expression and sanction so it would feel like unavutwa sana and that makes it easier for you to produce more milk because you're being stimulated to re to produce more milk so yes guys let me just undo everything to show you how to fix it when you're using a single pump so this is how <coughs> you're supposed to fix it when you're using just one bottle that is just one pump unatuanisha kila kitu from here you tore that part then you tore one of the tubes because you're using one bottle that is one pump so we keep this one aside and yes you just remove everything and then you directly connect this pipe hapa and then you have your one you have your single electronic <laughs> you have your single electric breast pump so there you go your he you can either use it on the left or on the right side of your breast hakuna difference so yes there you go it's still working as effective as when you would have used uh, it as a double pump so there you go more now what has happened Lenmongeza, the stimulation and expression part as in it sucks you kabisa that makes you produce milk kabisa like it sucks so much milk out of you so so let's talk positives about this particular breast pump over here so first of all i love that it has options of colors you can choose from white blue and pink that is so nice as in you're able to choose whichever color you would like other thing is it is very fast as in you guys compared to the manual one i manual will go on a shina but Unachoka, then ukiangalia kuna mazo inatoka you feel like you're not doing enough then as you get tired and mostly me misses when i pump is when baby when i've planned that i'm going to sleep so already kwa kichwa yangu najua ni talala so nishaanza kudoze and i'm there pumping it was so hectic and it was so tiresome so this one comes in handy because it is very efficient in pumping and it is very fast so the only work that you're doing over here is unashikilia too and make sure that you're holding family your everything works as efficiently as efficiently as and as effective as it should be the other thing is it is comfortable i was scared of using an electric pump the first time when i thought about it i'm gonna figure out you don't be going shock because when you're in steam in a pita kwamiliako like directly from the source of electricity in a kam kwamiliako and imagine you go shock kwa boobs and then what of pate uli ko na fanya ini so those are just my thoughts but when i tried it imagine it is very very comfortable and the feeling of how um your boob is being sanctioned is just the same as how your baby feeds on you so it's just the same as that so it is not weird it is not uncomfortable it is very comfortable it is simple to use the instruction manual that is there is very effective in how they explain things in how they name their the parts of the electric pump it is very 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 easy to use and simple to understand yes. i love that if it has an option of using it as a double electric pump and also as a single electric pump that gives you options on how you're going to use it kama mimi mostly i use it as a single electric pump because i'm always here in the house and the only time i'm pumping is every time when the baby is feeding so when ana feed on one boob i'm over here um um what is it called 
pumping on this other polini. <laughs> Mommy brain is still at work. So when I'm holding the baby feeding on one boob, I'm over here pumping on the other boobs. I love how they packed their everything inside this bag. So it is very easy to carry. You don't have to stress about nitaikawa busy little. There are the mobs and a quick kwa bag as in kwa handbag and so I love that they came in this bag and you can reuse it this bag you can wash it and reuse it as in this is nice this is nice and thoughtful of them so one positive that I forgot to talk about at how Aji is this electric pump is very affordable so I got mine at 2200 Bob and considering how effective it is I this one is a steal. So let's talk negatives about this particular electric breast pump. So one thing is I really, really, really wish that they had included this part inside as part of the those things that are inside the packaging. So if you don't have this, which are too happy. So make sure that if you're buying this, you also keep in mind that you'll have to buy this part. Mina to me, I am your simu. So if you don't have this in the house, you'll have to get one on the side. And the other thing is, my friends, kama hakuna steamer, kama tokens in Isha, you won't be able to express milk. You won't be able to pump milk. So that means that your your pumping schedule will be interrupted and you won't be as effective as you hoped to in terms of producing milk as you pump. It is, it is noisy. Mimi, you're so dear. It's too loud, especially when you siku in the middle of the night and you're pumping milk while breastfeeding, because that's the case for me. It's too loud. It's too loud. It will distract the baby while she is sleeping. I don't know about you if you have this particular um breast pump please niambia if yours is noisy come on a feeling noisy i'm an immediate and gonna issue <laughs> so yes being that it is an electric pump lazima ujue you have to strategically place yourself where there's a source of power otherwise ujojipato na ka mbelea tv kando ya gas kando ya mahali microwave vehicle then you have to plan for it think about where are you going to sit? How are you going to place yourself while you are breastfeeding? Or maybe even when you're not, is it comfortable for you to just sit Karibuna TV because that's where your source of power is? Think about that because if not, Pia, you'll have to plan for that. Otherwise, Pia, you'll have to get a power bank because that is easy to use. That's it guys, that's all about the electric breast pump and if you like what you see and you haven't subscribed, you are part of the 60% here, only how just subscribe. Please subscribe, it is free of charge. Thank you so much for watching, I'll catch you in the next one. Remember to hydrate, it's good for your skin, good for your hair and also good for your nursing baby. Until next time guys, go hairy. Mm.